Like yeah, this? That looks That's nice. Cool. Okay. Hi, what's up guys? It's your girl Marley. Stay tuned to see me answer a few questions about hair and how I like to wear my hair and a few experiences I've had with my hair. <clears throat> Get up. Question. So what has been your experience with lace fronts and where do you think it's going? Um, so at first, I was never really a big fan of lace fronts because I've never really had an experience with lace fronts. But then I came to Hair Queen LA, I got my first lace front and I was like, wow, you know, maybe I should start doing this because I don't have to dye my hair in order to change the hair color. I could just have a wig and it still look natural and cute. When it comes to looks, what's your top three model inspirations? Um, my top three model inspirations, number one, Kylie Jenner. That probably applies for everyone in the world because Kylie Jenner is a bad bitch. Number two, Bella Hadid for sure. She gives me like such a natural beauty. And number three, Kim Kardashian. Kim Kardashian's been the go for years. And whenever Kim Kardashian wears wigs, you can never tell if she's wearing a wig. It just always looks so clean and nice. Okay. What's your top two hairstyles in the game right now and why? So, my top two hairstylists in the game right now is one, Kida from Hair Queen LA because she does my lace wigs very well. She makes them look natural and flat and nice. And number two would definitely be Chris Appleton hair. He does Kim Kardashian's hair. I love how he styles her hair. And he makes all of her wigs and extensions look very seamless. What's your worst wig experience? And have a guy ever pulled your wig off while having sex? <laughs> so my worst wig experience is one time I went on Hollywood Boulevard and to this wig store and I bought this human hair bob. I was in a rush and I never used to take care of my hair. And um, it was like a U-Par wig. So instead of getting it sewed down, I got some hair glue and I glued it down like on my hair. And um, that's my worst wig experience. Now with the guy, one time I was with my um, previous boyfriend at the time and I literally woke up and my wig was on the floor and I just had braids on my hair. And I'm like, where's my wig? How did my wig get pulling off? Like, I didn't know how did my wig get like this on the floor? So yeah, those are my experiences. It was kind of crazy. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> I can't laugh because it hurts my stomach, y'all. Tell us about what you have up and coming. So right now I have my own clothing brand called Prissy Gals, and I'm doing a collaboration with Dolls Kill. So my brand will be inside of all Dolls Kill stores, Dolls Kill website. So I'm pretty excited for that. Are you single or are you taken? Well, I'm single until someone can handle me and respect everything that I want as somebody's significant other. So, what do you want to tell your fans before leaving today? Um, I want all my fans to know that it is good to always be yourself. People are going to hate no matter if you're doing good or bad, so it's best to do whatever you want to do. This is Marley. Thank you so much for tuning in. Comment below with what, any other questions you'd want me to ask, whoever you want to see. And if you want to be featured, comment below, let me know. Subscribe, repost, and tune in because there's many more to come.